All right, greetings. In this video, we're doing some integration. Um, I really don't know if this integral we're doing, uh, the integral we're doing, we're integrating uh, x minus one over x plus one. I'm not sure if this is an easy integral or a, or a hard integral. It really is something somebody posted on Facebook in one of the math groups I'm, I'm a member of, one of the many math groups I'm a member of, and they kind of posted like this was an interesting integral. So I did it. Uh, I had fun doing it. So I'm going to uh, do it with you. All right, so let's go ahead and get into it. Specialized in science and math, man. Original black man. Busting thoughts that pierce your mental the fierce, ripping your saxon. Vocal toe to toe, impeccable, splitting your back, son. Simple as addition and subtraction. Black thought, the infinite relax one. All right, so here's a given problem. Like many things in math, it can be done multiples of, of ways. And so uh, as you watch my solution, if you have a more efficient or a different way of doing it, uh, uh, please let me know in the comments. I will say something, something I'm, I'm guilty of when, when doing certain problems. Uh, sometimes, you know, I can do the problem, but you know, sometimes my method is not the most uh, efficient method ever. And, you know, there's a lot of cases where I do a certain problem a certain type of way for years. And then after so many years, I figure out oh, here's a lot easier way of doing this problem. So uh, go ahead and involve this solution and see what you think. And hopefully it's it's efficient enough. But again, if you got another efficient or a different way of doing this particular problem, let me know. All right, so we're integrating uh, X minus one over X plus one. And what I wanna do is I wanna split this integral into two uh, different integrals. So I wanna make this the integral of X over X plus one minus uh, the integral of one over X plus one dx. Uh, put the dx here, dx there. All right, so uh, that allows me, of course, uh, to easily integrate this one. Uh, that's going to be, you know, ln x plus one. So this is done. Now, this part, uh, you know, requires a little bit more to do this. And so the problem is this, this function here, x over x plus one, you know, you know, x over x plus k is better if it's x plus k over x. That's an easier integral to do versus x over x plus k. So uh, we do uh, a switch of rule is kind of what I call it. And, and the u sub can, can put this instead of x over x plus k form, it can put it into u plus k over u form, which is easier to maneuver. Uh, so to do this u substitution, I'm gonna say u equals x plus one which means du equals dx. But what also means is that u minus one equals x. So you can see what I'm doing is so, so this, this x dx will be u minus one du, and then my denominator would be u. So what you have when I do this substitution, again, x dx is u minus one du, so u minus one, and I'll put the du later, and then my denominator is simply u. So th this is what I'm integrating. And again, you know, u plus, I'm saying plus k, k could be positive or negative. So u plus k over u uh, is a lot easier than x over x plus k. And so now we can just divide both these by u, if you will. And it's the integral of du minus the integral of one over u du. So I'm just dividing, you know, u divided by u is one. And of course, one divided by u is one divided by u. So now I can integrate all of this stuff. So let's go ahead and do the integration. And so the integral of du is, is u, of course. And, and what is u? Well, u is x plus one. So that's x plus one minus uh, the integral of one over u is ln u and what's u again u is x plus one so minus ln x plus one and then remember here earlier uh, we've this one that we separated so these two answers represent the integral of x over x plus one and we also have minus the integral of one over x plus one which of course is minus ln x plus one plus some constant. So that's what we have there. Of course, we can combine uh, these two together. And so we'll have 
x plus 1 minus 2 ln x plus 1 plus c. All right, so there you have it. So that was the integral for that particular problem. Again, you know, I don't know if it was, you consider that an easy problem or a hard problem, but I thought it was fairly fascinating. And uh, more than that, it was a very fun problem to do. We'll see you next time.